Members of 70s pop rock band Sherbet liked cricket so much they incorporated the sport's famous appeal into a love song. Keyboardist Garth Porter and bassist Tony Mitchell wrote the anthem How's That, which became a number one hit in Australia, reached the top five in the UK and even hit 61 on the charts in the USA. In what may be a surprise to many, the founding members of 80s folk pop band The Go-Betweens, Grant McLennan and Robert Forster, were huge cricket fans. Both would discuss the fortunes of the Australian cricket team before songwriting and rehearsal sessions, and Robert Forster was a promising player, knocking up centuries as a junior cricketer. Singer-songwriter Paul Kelly is a famous cricket tragic who has penned a number of cricket-themed songs, including the biographical epic Bradman and a song about the Boxing Day test called Behind the Bowler's Arm. At least half of the band in excess, the Farris brothers, Andrew, John and Tim, were cricket fans. The band would often meet up with the Australian cricket team when both were on tour. Drummer John Farris recorded a song with Sir Vivian Richards in 2015 and guitarist Tim was once chairman of Sydney's Manly Warringah District Cricket Club. While no members of Midnight Oil are known for their cricketing ability, one has it in his genes. Lead singer Peter Garrett is the great-grandson of Tom Garrett, who played in 19 test matches for Australia, including the very first one in 1877. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.